Hey, welcome back. Please consider liking and subscribing. If I get 50 subscribers, I can live stream some Fortnite. It would really help me out the time. Heading into time trials. One, go! Um, I'm running three laps, trying to get. I like to set my personal goal of uh, up 20. Top 20, but. I ran a good lap on the first lap, but you know the first lap never counts because it's always. It doesn't give you a head start on your ride or run. So I usually don't count the first lap. The second lap I mess up a little bit, and then the third lap I kind of just mess it up really bad. I hit the wall, and then I hit the wall over here too, and end up spinning. So my best lap, 8.930, puts me in not so high of a spot, knowing that. I ended up getting, like, top 30. Heading into our heat race, I think I was, I in my heat, I started fifth. But only four people showed up, so I got to start four. Not too bad of a race. It was really, really actually fun to race. I was running bottoms and top. This is a very small track, and every time I'd drive the bottom, I wouldn't turn too much, and I would hit the wall. So I tried the top, but every time I just couldn't get around this track without hitting the wall. So I was trying to watch these guys up in the front and see how fast they're heading into the corners and stuff. It's really hard to figure out what the lane you want to run on these tracks. Because what I do is I sign up and then I just run them all at once. Run the time trial, wait a little bit, run the heat race, and then run A. But it's hard sometimes because if I don't make it to the A, the video's probably going to be a little longer. So I have to edit down a little bit. But this one isn't too much, too long of a video. Kind of just talking through what's happening. When I was running through this um, heat, it was felt like it was going really fast. Because once I I was ready to start making a move like right now on this guy in front of me, but as I hit, I was coming down under trying to get under him, and I had I hadn't I hadn't looked at what lap I was on at all, and I tried to get down under him on this lap. I was like, oh, I might actually be able to catch up to him. And then I realized, oh my gosh, the race is over. Okay. Ended up finishing fourth in my heat, having put eighth in the A. Or eighth in the B. So now I'm not going to voice over much on the B main. All I was going to say is that the start was a little hectic. As, I'm, as of every single time I start, it's harder to find a line from the bottom. I know that's hard to say because in most things you want to start on the bottom. But here, I wanted to start on the top. Luckily, I kind of got a good start here. Kind of running third, but then I ended up messing up and getting put back to seventh and running my way back up to six. So I'm watching. Bye.
Now this was a hectic aiming. Since I made it in the sixth spot in the B, as you guys have just watched, I got put in dead last for the A. Last transfer spot. So this is me just trying to run on the laggy laggy laps because there were 16 other people. This was a stacked race. Kind of just trying to make sure that I run better laps and better lap times. Because if I run better laps, then I feel better even if I didn't get a good race. As you guys see, it's very hectic, but I powered through it. Good luck. Thanks for watching. Peace out. If you guys made it this far, like and subscribe and comment anything you want in the comments, let me know. Thanks for watching.